We can find the difference by adding tens and then adding units. So we have 84 subtract 43. So if we start on 43, we're going to count on until we get to 84. So if we count up in tens, we get 53, 63, 73, 83, and I'm not going to add any more tens because the next ten would be 93, and that would be too many. It would be above the number that we're aiming for. So we've counted on four tens. And now if we add one, we get to 84, so we have one unit. So 84 subtract 43 is 41, or the difference between 84 and 43 is 41. But perhaps we could do this in fewer steps. So if you add 40 all in one go, you get to 83, so you're adding four tens to get to 83, and then one more gives you 84, so we have 41 because you've added one unit. Now 71 minus 56, so we can start on 56, 10 more gives us 66, and we can't, ha and we can't add any more tens because 76 would be too many, so we have just one 10. And now we can count on from 66 until we get to 71. So 67, 68, 69, 70, and 71. So we've added five units to give us our answer of 15. You could do this in fewer steps, so you still add 10 to make 66, so you have 110. But if you're on 66, four more would take you to 70, and one more takes you to 71. So you have five units because you've added four and you've added one, so five altogether. Now 82 subtract 58. So if we're counting in tens from 58, we have 68, 78, and we're going to stop there. Why, aren't, why are we not going to add another 10? Well, if we added another 10, we'd have 88, and that would be too many. So we have two tens. And now we can count on from 78 79, 80, 81, and now we get to 82. So we've counted on four units, and that makes our answer 24. So how could you do 82 minus 58 in fewer steps? Well, you could go all the way from 58 to 78, adding 20, or two tens. And now two more gets us to 80. Another two gets us to 82. So that's four units altogether, because two plus two makes four. Now 70 minus 38. Pause the video and see if you can find the difference by counting forwards in tens then units. So counting on in tens, we have 48, 58, 68, and 78 would be too many, so we stop at three tens. And now we can, now we can count on in units, 69, 70, so we counted on two units to get to 70. So the difference between 70 and 38 
is 32. Or in fewer steps, you might be able maybe to jump all the way to 68, so adding 30, and then jump to 70, so adding 2.